Now today's video is sponsored by Kano, and we're gonna be taking a look today at their custom computer kit that is designed from the ground up to make kids excited about technology. Now they advertise that this is designed for kids six and up to build the computer, learn how to set it up, how to program on it, and actually program their own little scripts and games and, and just anything you can think of. And it's designed to make kids her age ready for this world of technology. And I thought that this was a perfect opportunity for those viewers uh, who have kids or maybe are kids at heart themselves to check this thing out. I've waited a couple months to do this. I'm finally doing it and I can't wait. Now I'm gonna kinda guide the video through here, but really this is about the kids and what it's like for the kids to use this kit. So that's why we've got little Jay here. She's gonna be doing most of the work here uh, and I'm just gonna kinda make sure that you know we, we keep on track. Cause we, you know kids, they get a little distracted. Yeah. If you see something shiny, are you gonna run away? Sometimes I am get distracted on my homework if I see my mom doing something cool and I'm like, what are you doing? And then I like completely forget about what I'm doing and I um, get off track. Of it. I was taking a kind of quick tour around the box. It's Kano Orange. It says Computer Kit on here. And on the back, it kind of talks about what it is we're going to look at today. I mean, it's got a music app in there, games, um, Hack Snake, Minecraft, Pong, other games that they can program, hack, and play with. Um, you can learn how to code. You can, it even has video output. You can hook this up to anything with an HDMI and HD software or HD input, and, and you can use this on TVs, monitors, whatever else. Uh, I, I can't wait. So go ahead and Let's go ahead and unbox this thing and see what is inside. Remember, this is a complete kit. It's everything you need in one box. There we go. Now, when you open the box, the first thing you see on the inside here is everything is guided. I mean, you've got different manuals here, step one, step two, step three, and it's, it's intended to take you from beginning to end to get to uh, where you want to be with this kit. Um, nice little pamphlet in here talking more about the product. Nice little foam cover there, and look at that. Mm -hmm. Now real quickly, what comes in the box here, it comes with a wireless keyboard and trackpad. So this is how you're gonna control everything. Mm -hmm. It's got a big yellow HDMI cable here. So everything's nice and big in color, bright color coordinated. It makes it a lot easier for kids. Uh, we have got a, US, a micro USB plug right here, flat cable, a red one. I uh, also forgot to mention the HDMI is a flat cable. And then of course we have got the computer components that all have to be put together. Here's the speaker. Um, it's pretty much based off of Raspberry Pi, so it's gonna make it very, very simple. Here's the power adapter. Um, here's the power brick. So this thing does run off micro USB power. And then here is everything else right here. Now I'm not gonna mess with this because I want you to put all this together. Now obviously step one is to build the thing, so why don't we go ahead and do that? What do you say? Yeah. You wanna build it? Mm -hmm. Can you do it? You th that doesn't sound very confident. Can you do it? Yes. Let's try that again. <laughs> can you build this? Yes, I can. Putting the Kano together is really easy. It's 11 easy pieces to put together with the design concept of being as simple to use as Legos. All kids know how to use Legos. Yeah. You've got like what, thousands of them. My cousin has like 5,000 Legos. Her cousin has 5,000 Legos. Well now you've got 11 more here that is basically a Raspberry Pi 2, uh, very easy to put together. All of the instructions are right here in very nicely illustrated manual that Kids have no problems using. Uh, they say that this is recommended for ages six and up. They think the sweet spot's right around ages nine or 10. 
uh, but she had no problems at age six. The moment you plug it into power, it boots up and it starts guiding you through a little coding sequence to put in your name and then you've got to follow this white rabbit that gets lost in the memory of the Raspberry Pi. Uh, and then you have to put in some code to keep a bomb from going off. It's actually really, really cool. The, everything inside the desktop is guided. Um, there's also another manual here, step two, that's designed to kind of guide you through the best way to start using the coding functions and learning the kind of the most efficient route and where to start and the you know progression of learning code inside of the Kano software here. One of our favorite things to play is Minecraft. And what's cool about this is Minecraft is included on here, but it also has a hack function where you can hack the game and start playing with the code and setting up the world as you see fit uh, by using code. And it's pretty neat because it's all a visual representation of code where you drag puzzle pieces and complete the blocks because you know just like code you have to have a you have to have your statement and you have to complete it and it has to make sense and it has to be correct. Well, the the building puzzle pieces on this for the code show you a visual representation of how code works, which is exactly why it's tailored towards kids because it's something kids understand, puzzle pieces and doing some very simple problem solving. So it's not even something that only kids can enjoy. Adults can enjoy this as well. And it makes it, if you've never seen a piece of code whatsoever, it'll start to make sense because rather than just being a bunch of text in a notepad, it's all puzzle pieces that start to make sense on how the flow of code works. So they use Python and JavaScript on a lot of their coding methodology in here, which is a very common language and can get you started doing a lot of really cool things. And you can even play music on here by using computer code, which is really, really neat. Uh, it's really endless. And if you go to Kano World and set up an account, there's even more that you can do and you can download. This thing is fully wirelessly connected to the internet. It also has an RJ45 adapter on it so that you can plug it into a wired internet if you want. And a simple HDMI output so that you can hook it up to any TV or monitor. It's very, very simple. Obviously the footprint is small and you can set this thing up anywhere. Now don't just take my word for it. In fact, this has been featured on Forbes, Wired, The Guardian, Wall Street Journal, BBC, Fast Company, Recode, CSNBC, Quartz, USA Today, CNN, CNN Money, Fortune, TNW, Time, BuzzFeed, and more tech outlets have actually featured this computer kit from Kano. So it's something definitely worth taking a look at, which is why when they approached me about sending me one for Little J to try out, really what I think about it doesn't matter. It really matters how the kids feel. And as you can see, she's having no problems whatsoever, just apparently encasing herself in a room made of, what is that, diamond blocks? I think. We think? I don't know, it's a blue block. I guess it's maybe a diamond block. It has yellow in the middle. Blue block with yellow in the middle. If you know what the blue block with yellow in the middle is in Minecraft, put it down in the comments. Anyway, if you want to check this out for yourself or your child or do it together, this has actually been a fun experience to do together here. Um, then head over to us.cano.me. There's a link in the description and you can check out the different options they have. There are multiple kits, different levels of kit that you can get for this and it's definitely worth checking out. Anyway, thanks for watching today's video. A uh, huge thank you again to Kano for sponsoring today's video. Little J absolutely loves this thing to death and it's probably gonna end up utilizing another monitor of mine full time for her to be able to hook this up and play with it. But I'm okay with that because this is only going to make her smarter while having fun at the same time. The coding makes you think you're playing a game, but really you are learning how to program and that is definitely the future in the world that we're looking at today. So anyway, thanks for watching. Let me know in the comments how you guys felt about this. Don't forget to check out the link. Head over to Kano, get yours today, and I, you really can't go wrong with this. Anyway, see you guys in the next video, and uh, I don't know, maybe we'll do another one in the future and see how her progression is going on this. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one.